Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? So, uh, I'm going to try UFC beta, UFC 3 beta on the Xbox One X. I'm going to try it now on TCL 55-inch P605 model. And the one thing that always strikes me about this uh, television, it's the uh, full real local dimming, you know. It has really awesome deep dark levels here. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try to do a performance mode for about a couple of minutes and then I'm going to switch back to a uh, 4K mode. So let's resume. There we go. Look at those deep dark levels. Looks amazing, man. There goes Conor McGregor. I'm very impressed uh, with uh, this beta, considering it's beta and they're truly uh, making some great progress here in terms of graphics and, of course, the 4K resolution and performance resolution. I'm gonna try to uh, zoom in a little bit closer. There we go, like that. To give you guys a little bit better. Uh, All right, let's just jump right into this. Now, this, right now, it's 4K. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch back to... Uh, to favorite performance. And performance is definitely the best way to uh, get the best out of uh, UFC. I think majority of you will be using a performance mode because performance mode truly gives you that accuracy and, and really zero lag, which you will see right here. So now you're getting that uh, 60 FPS here. With the 60 FPS, much better performance. You know, the, the character is much fluidly moving you see it looks more natural now when it's like this so performance mode is definitely the best mode to go with see now I'm not really good at this game so I'm just like I need to spend some more time, but I'm just like showing you the difference between these uh, two different types of modes. I mean, it still looks great graphically. It's not a 4K resolution. It's uh, probably, I'm guessing 1440p or something like that. Oh, 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 here we go. Get up, get up. Top mount, come on, come on. There you go. Now get up. There you go. All right, so now I'm gonna switch back to uh, 4K mode. And also, uh, I would recommend when you switch to a 4k mode that you keep your camera on a tight mode because the tight mode really gives you that up close uh camera angle of the fighters it looks more realistic now i notice you know it's more sharper more vivid you know it looks more detailed 
That's it. That's it, bitch. You're done. Come on, get up. Come on, come on. Get up, get up. All right, don't let him choke you, God damn it. Ah, oh, come on. There you go. That's it. Get that bitch. <laughs> That's it. Post her up. Get get him. Get that son of a done. So with an uh 4K resolution, you get much better detail. It's going to look more realistic. It's going to look more jaw dropping when you have it in 4K. But if you want that performance, if you want that performance mode, then you're truly going to have that best possible experience. But, it, you know, it's not bad in, in a 4K resolution either. With the 4K resolution, you still get... Uh, you still get a great uh, experience overall but it's just not as fluid as the performance mode. That's it, bitch. Oh, come on, come on. Back sitting, get him, get him. Top mount, come on, get this bitch. <laughs> and get up, get up. No, I want to get up, dude. Come on. Oh shit. How did this happen? Oh, come on. Um my only complaint I always had about UFC it's the controls. The controls in UFC they always felt to me complex. You know, they always felt too complex. Like you have to really, uh, it's almost like you're controlling a mothership. You have to press so many goddamn buttons, you know, to achieve something. Uh, and I felt that it was too, too complex and too out of place. And I still feel the same if the EA is watching this. Seriously, get rid of these stupid controls. Uh, the controls, it's what's holding you back of having this uh, UFC game be a great game. Get rid of these stupid formula controls. Do something new, okay? Make it a little bit more fluid, much better, all right? I hate to be pressing seven to eight, ten fucking buttons to achieve something, all right? Make it a bit simpler. Make it a bit easier, okay? Don't make it look like a spaceship control. No, really, it is like a spaceship control. Way too many gotten buttons you have to press, to achieve grappling, then to achieve a ground game, back sitting, posture up, you know, and it's, it's too much, man. All right? And it's not fun. So that's my thought on it. Fix the damn controls. They're horrible. All right, so there you have it, guys.